Down on Lonely Street. That is my brother Bruce, and yes, that is. Uh, yeah, that's all original. 
that that uh, that is sim rating that uh, the whole ship the whole shebang the whole nine yards and yeah uh, Bruce has been doing this for oh god let's see uh well, he's been writing music probably for at least close to 50 years 48 50 years I'd say yeah and that's that's my little bro way to go little bro you betcha anyway uh we're going to be getting in some regular tunes here and then we're going to probably have a little bit of we'll have a little bit of kind of canoes the canoes you know is just so i don't know yeah it makes me fuzzy let's put it that way the news makes you guys fuzzy i mean it, it's all the same old crap old i'm telling you yeah it's all the same and the sad thing is the all the same the biggest part of it and the news is ukraine um uh, being part of ukraine myself i'm telling you i don't know my grandma she came home from ukraine and uh i'm telling you of course she's been long gone but man i'm telling you when i hear those people talk with their accent oh man i get goosebumps i uh, oh man i'm telling you uh if i was a little younger and i could get over that day i think i'd go over and fight i really do i mean i, I got a little bit of my fighting i was you know I was in Vietnam, but then again, the, the fighting there was nothing for me, really. I, I was very fortunate, but then only to come back, as thousands and thousands of us do, to come back to find out that we've got certain different kind of cancers and lung problems and brain problems and all sorts of crap, lots of different kind of cancers, and uh, we come back with it, and it, all of a sudden it just shows up. I, I I didn't have any symptoms, nothing. Uh, two days after my 72nd birthday, which is in January, uh, I found out. What I thought all along, and the doctors did too, was, and were kind of treating it, was like a urinary tract infection, UTI. Well, it turned out it wasn't UTI. It, yeah. So anyway, there we go. You betcha, ain't that right there, the old Popeye, you old fart, 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 you old and I don't know if I've got another one here or not. Anyway, yeah, uh, very talented man. Um, let's see, what do we got? Oh, you guys love this one. I know it. Are you ready? Benny Hill, God bless you. What say the Queen? <laughs> That's Benny Hill, man. I can just, I can, but when I play that, I can, I can see him running down the hospital, <laughs> chasing, uh, chasing the nurses with the big cleavages, and uh, he's got his doctor uh, Schmack on, his, not, Doctor Spock, no, Mister Schmack, not him, uh, and he's chasing, <laughs> he, he's got the stethoscope uh, around his neck, and he wants to give the nurses, uh, check their heart. <laughs> Oh, oh my God! You gotta love Benny. You betcha. I know it, guys. I'm telling you, he, he's something else. I love old Benny. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. So well, that's it. As far as the news goes, guys, that's it. Deep rain, and I tell it. I'm telling you right now. If never, not never. If ever, a world should step up without any question, any reserve any politics involved should help another country it's ukraine right now simply put when you've got innocent beautiful children being murdered and killed women raped tortured 
I mean, you know, what? I can't think of anything really worse. How would? How can you not get involved? You have to get involved. That's all there is to it. Oh man, makes us sick. Come on, Biden, get off your ass. I'm not saying send in troops, probably just yet, but I am saying let's see some really tons of weapons going over there. They should have blew with that. When they were first going in there with that Ford, and they just, just kept on throwing it in, in, a, in a news media's face. 40 mile long goddamn convoy of tanks and trucks and shit Russia, from Russia coming on in. No. They should have been blown all the hell within the, within the first couple days, if not hours. So I, 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 I'm not a military strategist by no stretch of the imagination, but I do know a little bit of common sense, and a li I have a little common sense, and I do know a little bit about warfare. I really wish they should have done something. They, they didn't even have to send in jets. Then you got the no fly zone and fly zone, and that's a bunch of bullshit too. Send in the drones. That's all you had to do. Send in about, I don't know, how many uh, missile rockets and drones home, but, uh, hold, but the drones could have definitely took care of that uh, convoy right from the get-go. Anyway, all right, you're listening to Fuzzies. I got to, see, that's why I call myself Fuzzy. I guess, oh yeah, Fuzzies Walker's Mafia Inc. podcast. You betcha. We're just starting this, uh, they went out, uh, formerly was known as Captain Boomer's podcast. But old Fuzzy kicked the old captain out. Fuzzy's uh, moving along here. All right, you betcha. Okay, what else we got? What else we got, Bob? Huh? Oh, just some paraphernalia, just to throw out some stuff. I got some stuff I can throw out for the bo the boomers, don't you know? Yeah, yeah. White Castle potato chips. What do you guys think about that? They had a uh, about five years ago. They had a contest. With different flavors of of, uh, of potato chips. I think it was Lay's. Well, the, uh, uh, myself and my crew down here at the old station here, we came up with ours, and they came in third place. Yeah, yeah, huh? Do you guys remember that? Huh? Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Uh, we came in third place, and our entry was White Castle flavored potato chips. Huh? What do you guys think of that? I think it's a good one. <laughs> you betcha. And anyway, we took third place. Yeah, you betcha. Okay, I've got to remember this, guys. Got to remember this. You can tune a piano, but you can't tune a fish. You betcha. Yeah. <laughs> Elmer Fudd and Porky Pig are, uh, are going to be telemarketers. Really? Oh my God! Can you imagine that? Elmer Fudd and Porky Pig. Every, 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 every. Oh jeez! Well, be bad, we bad, we careful. Be bad, we bad, we careful. Doctor Ruth, you betcha that little Hungarian broad. Remember her? Oh yeah, she's a sex therapist back in the seventies and eighties. Doctor Ruth, I don't even know if she's still alive. You guys remember her, right? That little midget? Yeah. Oh, ma'am, she had some explicit stuff on there she talked about. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What's this? Burning barrels of shit for a buck and a quarter an hour in Vietnam. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was great. Yeah. Oh, this was for Putin. I didn't fart. My ass just blew you a kiss. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. You betcha. And the people at Mars Magazine stands for Medicated and Retired Seniors. Mars Magazine. Remember that name, guys, because I tell you, they're a lot better than art. You betcha. They're more in-depth, and uh, they got a little bit better sense of humor. Art doesn't have any sense of humor at all. Um, what can you expect from a name like Arp? Arp. You know, it sounds like a freaking seal. Arp. I mean, come on. Anyways, uh, yeah, Arp.